In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your HP NY 6155E all-in-one printer with the Windows 11 laptop. This is a complete setup. This will include the initial setup, wireless setup, and then we will add in our Windows laptop. So let's start with the setup process. Plug in the power cable at the back of the printer and switch it on. Power button is at the back side of the printer. Now go to the printer display panel, select the language and confirm. Select country of residence. On the next page it will ask you to go to the setup website but we are not going there we will just do the setup using our printer. Now the next step is to load the paper. Remove the paper tray. Now you can adjust the size using this. Load A4 size or letter size paper. Close it. It will ask you to confirm on the screen. Press OK. Next is to install the setup in cartridges. Take the ink cartridges out of this plastic packaging. Lift your printer from this section. Ink chamber is there. It should be in its position. Take the ink cartridges. Now remove the seal. There should be no orange seal here. And then place it here. Once it goes in, you have to push it in with your hand. Now push it in, it will lock. Same with the black ink cartridge. Push it in. Now close the ink chamber. Press the door down from the same place. Go to the display panel. Go to the display panel. Ink is installed successfully. Press OK. Printer needs alignment, so we'll do that. Click on the align. Wait for the alignment page to come, and this is the paper output tray. Next step is to scan this page. Open the scanner lid. Place it facing down and push it to the other side of the corner. Close the lid. Click on the scan icon. So it might take a couple of minutes. Now this printer is capable of doing the two sided automatic printing. But you have to enable that. Once you enable it, it will start printing that. You can also do the scanning, wireless printing, wireless scanning with this printer. This printer can be used with the USB cable, that is a printer cable. If you don't want to use home or office Wi-Fi network, then you can use that option. Moreover, you can also use it with the inbuilt Wi-Fi, that is Wi-Fi direct of the printer. If you don't have USB cable, if you don't have home Wi-Fi network, 
then you can use the inbuilt Wi-Fi. So we'll wait for the alignment page to finish its work and then we will do the wireless setting of the printer or Wi-Fi setting of the printer. So our alignment scanning is almost done. In the meantime you can download the HP Smart app in your Windows 11 laptop. Scanning is done. So go to the printer display panel and then click on the OK button. On the panel again it will ask you to return to the setup website. But right now we will not do that. We will do the setup using this screen. Click on this question mark. Scroll down. It says get HP software. But we will go in to do the. But we will do exit from here. Then it will say skip HP software. So we are ready to skip it. Exit. For updates scroll down. And then this button will be activated click next you can select auto updates or you can select notify and then click on the save you can select date and time for your printer and click continue thanks for choosing HP plus ok you will see the main screen of the printer but still we have to do the wireless setup of the printer the Wi-Fi light is blue light that is blinking it should be stable when it is connected. Click on the menu. Scroll down and click on the settings icon. Select network. Here we have few options like Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi direct, Bluetooth, low energy. AirPrint is already activated. Now let's start with the home Wi-Fi network setup. Click on the Wi-Fi, select Wi-Fi setup, start, it will give you the list of wireless networks, you just have to select your Wi-Fi, that's the list here, select, click next. At this screen we have to enter the Wi-Fi password, select it, use the keypad and enter your home Wi-Fi network password. You can also select this I button and it will display whatever the password you are entering. If you see anything is wrong you can just click here and it will go back. So you just have to enter the complete password of the printer. Once you enter a complete password press OK. Submit. Press OK to confirm. It will connect your Wi-Fi network but it depends upon the signal strength of the Wi-Fi. In case you are having issue here at this moment if it's not connecting then move your printer near to the router so that it can connect easily. Once the connection is successful, press OK. Click on the home button. Now go to your Windows 11 laptop. Open HP Smart App. You can download it from the App Store. Once you open the app, we have to add the printer so click on the add printer icon and make sure your laptop is already connected to the same Wi-Fi network. In the list you have to look for the HP NY 6100E series so it gives two options setup if you still want to do the setup using this you can just click here if you just want to add it you can click on this so you may get one or two options. So if I select here, automatically it will add up the printer. Select all printing services. This printer comes with the trial for ink. 
so if you want you can do that now go to the printer display panel confirm here allow we need to enter the pin of the printer that is at the back side if you go to the back of the printer you will see there is a sticker here and it has a pin number so you have to enter that pin in the screen once you enter it click on the submit it will ask you if you want to activate the HP plus if you want to enroll for that you can do that or you can just scroll down and click on the do not activate HP plus you can decline this offer or you can continue with the offer click on the continue if you have a HP account you can sign in or if you don't have you can create it or you can skip the account activation this will also give you the option for instant ink but you can skip it so right now we can click on the do not enable ink delivery scroll down and click on the skip the offer if you want you can also click on the remind me later so we have already done the installed the paper for updates you can select auto updates or notify when it is available for some reason it is asking the pin number again you have to enter it if you want you can send link to other devices or you can skip it we can print the welcome page or we can skip this page as well and then you will see your printer with estimated level of ink and then we can start using it for wireless printing and scanning thanks for watching